just putting the finishing touches in on this fur. Just kind of wanted to do a little bit of a demo. I've been drawing this in the art gallery today. And just letting people stop by and watch and see the progress from start to finish. This is a white chalk pencil, which I'm using to just draw in some of the highlights on these ridges of fur, like right in there, there, and over the cub, just like that. And you can see I can kind of draw in some of the little hairs. assortment of pencils just laid out at the moment. And I've been using more of the um, richer, redder browns as we go down into the shadow and the softer, creamier browns up here in the highlights. And that kind of gives a little bit of an impression of like some luminescence on the fur, a little bit of glow. And it also helps enhance the shadows without the bear just being dark brown and light brown, you know, as if, as if it was only just two colors. So that's, you can kind of see some of the effect there. And then just a few lines to kind of break up that edge. And then I've been trying to lose a little bit of some of the edges, like right in here, just to kind of make that transition a little bit more solid, but still kind of implied. And for the cub, what I did was I started with a, a base of this color, kind of a magenta color. Well, not magenta, but a reddish brown, um, more on the red side. So I started with just a soft base of that, and then I've come back over it with darker and darker browns to kind of draw in these little shadows. You can see like the, the hints of fur that I'm putting in like that. And that also helps give it a redder color than the mama bear. So it's not just the value that stands out, but the, the color as well. This is also a different kind of paper than I've used before too. It's not quite mylar, but it does have some properties like that too. So it's slicker and smoother. Um, there's like no tooth to it. It's very, very smooth, but it sure does take colored pencil beautifully. I'm just really liking how well it's taking this colored pencil. And then it's keeping some of the, um, some of the shine to it too, so. And you can see up close how it's keeping a lot of that detail in place. So there you go. That's that's my project for today. I'll just do a little bit of last minute touches here, just on, on this little edge. Just to kind of help it stand out from Mama. And there you go, a little 8x10 drawing. <laughs>